can't really miss the big Brighton SEO sign. Um, starting to feel nervous again. More real. <laughs> Feels very real now. So I'm in Brighton. I'll be getting on stage and I'm going to be speaking about um, forget what you thought you knew about relevancy. Um, so I'm hoping that quite a lot of people who I know are coming and they follow me on Twitter um, are going to come and, and see me talk. So it'll be really nice to see some faces in real life. It's going to be an exciting day. Relevancy is a really hot topic at the moment. Um, so people talk about relevancy in relation to digital PR. So is it relevant to my target audience? Is it relevant to the brand? But you've also got to make sure that your PR ideas are relevant to the keywords that you want to rank for, because not only is that great from a digital PR perspective, but that's ultimately what's going to help your rankings on Google. We have arrived, yeah. You can't really miss the big Brighton SEO sign. Um, starting to feel nervous again. More real. <laughs> Feels very real now. It's come true, oh baby. We're making all your dreams come true. Free coffee and free bag. Free coffee and free bag. But I'm not having the coffee yet because I don't want to get too jittery. Dan Peden, our client strategy director, top tip from him, never have coffee before an event or before you speak because you'll just speed up too much and maybe get a bit sweaty. <laughs> just, yeah, just avoid coffee, really. I've got half an hour to go. 30 minutes. about as a PR person if you've got a linking piece of coverage. So how is an online blinds retailer ranking higher for key terms than the likes of Donnell and Hillary? And finally, the total number of links doesn't matter at all. The best way to tell Google what your website is all about is by doing product-led coverage or using coverage to talk about the services that you offer by providing expert tips and advice. Yes, I've just got off stage and I do think it went well. People seem to be quite engaged with it and I think it might be something that not many people have heard before. I think hopefully it's something a bit different. Just had a quick sneak on my phone and on Twitter and I've got loads of notifications, so I feel popular. I really enjoy events like this. I think it's a great opportunity um, to network and obviously engage and also educate. Um, hopefully my talk really resonated with people. Um, I did get some great feedback afterwards, so, so that's been lovely. So now I can go and have a nice large glass of wine and just relax a little bit. I would love to hang around and, and go and watch some more talks, but um, it's our summer smash tonight at North Yorkshire, so I need to catch my train. Four hour trip to York, and then I'm gonna get a 45 minute taxi to get to our summer smash, um, where I hope I've got a large vino waiting for me. The journey will be worth it. Probably gonna have a few um, G&Ts on the train as well. <laughs>